Thomas Alive Today presents... Foley's. In 1900 Foley Brothers was founded by brothers Pat and James Foley, two young and enterprising Irishmen, on February 12th with $2,000 borrowed from an uncle. The 1,400-square-foot store located at 507 Main Street in Houston, Texas, was stocked with calico, linen, lace, pins, needles, and men's furnishings. In 1905 with business booming, Pat and James purchased the building next door and added ready-to-wear clothing for women and children as well as millinery. In 1911, the store moved to the 400 block of Main Street and was incorporated with capital of $150,000. In 1916, Foley Brothers ranked third in retail volume in Houston with $400,000 in sales. The original 10 employees had grown to 150, and the company had 750 active charge accounts and 23,000 square feet of space. In 1917, Pat and James sold Foley Brothers to George S. Cohen and George's father, Robert, a Galveston merchant. Foley Brothers grew tremendously under this new management and by 1919, sales neared $1 million. In 1922, Foley Brothers moved into a three-story building next door to 400 Main Street. Later that year, the store became the city's largest department store. Shoes, a beauty shop, and radio sets were included. In 1941, when the United States entered World War II, Foley Brothers diverted the efforts of the advertising and personnel departments to bond drives and other wartime services. All sales promotions were suspended during this time. In 1945, Federated Department Stores President Fred Lazarus Jr. came to Houston to visit his son, who was stationed at a nearby army camp. Mr. Lazarus discovered that Foley Brothers was for sale and bought it. In 1947, Foley's opened at 1110 Main Street on October 20th in downtown Houston. Federated spent $13 million to build this new store, which was heralded by the press as the nation's most modern department store. By 1951 the first official Foley's Thanksgiving Day Parade was held. In 1961, Foley's opened its first branch store at the Sharpstown Shopping Center and continued to add Houston branches over the next five decades. In the 1970s, Foley's opened stores in Austin and in the 1980s opened in San Antonio. By 1987, Foley's absorbed Federated's Dallas-based Sanger Harris chain with stores in the Dallas-Fort Worth Metroplex, Oklahoma City, Oklahoma, Tulsa, Oklahoma, Tucson, Arizona, and Albuquerque, New Mexico. In 1988, Federated was purchased by real estate developer Compo Corporation, which immediately sold Foley's along with Feline's to May Department Stores to finance its deal. In two years Federated filed for bankruptcy, disassociated itself from Compo, and merged with Campo's other retail holding company Allied Stores. After its acquisition by May Company, Foley's closed several stores in Dallas it considered underperforming including the downtown Dallas flagship store and its Albuquerque, New Mexico, location, while also taking over two Lord & Taylor stores, one that was under construction in late 1988 at Penn Square Mall in Oklahoma City, part of the mall's 1986-1988 expansion, and the other at San Antonio's shops at River Center. Over the next decade, May spent heavily to build new stores, replace outdated stores and refurbish existing stores. In 1993, May Department Stores consolidated May Daniels and Fisher into Foley's, which brought Foley's to the Denver Aurora, Colorado Springs, Boulder and Fort Collins Loveland markets and reintroduced Foley's to the Albuquerque market. On February 2, 1997, the two Arizona locations both in Pima County were transferred to May's Robinson's May Division. In 2001, Foley's expanded into Louisiana after May Company acquired several Maison Blanche locations that have become Parisian stores from Profits Now Saks Incorporated. Foley's was reacquired by Federated when it took over May Department Stores on August 30, 2005. In 2006, Federated started the conversion of Foley's into Macy's. Soon advertisements started to read Foley's, now part of the Macy's family. On September 9, 2006, the Foley stores were renamed Macy's as part of Federated's nationwide rebranding of all former May locations. In 2005 Federated announced that it would close Foley's 1,200 employee headquarters in downtown Houston. Foley's President's Day sale going on now. Check today's paper for 12 bonus coupons, good through Friday. This is where it all starts, this is where it gets good. If you have any fond memories, please indicate it at the comments below.
Thanks for watching, subscribe and like.